Hi guys, okay, I just wanted to shoot this really quick video, which is more of an add-on to the previous video. Um, I'm going to jump straight into it and show you a new technique. So what I've done is I've loaded up the Realtor page that we used in the previous video. Um, I've got rid of the login because that's not what I wanted to show you. What I've done is uh, scraped using the element scrape that we used previous in the previous video for the person's name. Um, and also the company or the real estate company that he works for and now what I want to show you is something that you're going to use a lot it's a really basic example though um, I'm not sure if you've watched the video on writing data to files but this is a good example of doing that live in the field so what I've done is I've um, gone to the sorry to our toolbox and selected file systems and then write data to file and what I've done is I've just told it where to write the information. You could of course have used a resource for this, but this is just a demo, so I typed it in by hand. And the data that I've asked it to write is the company, uh, the variable name text, so that's the person's name, and then a comma, and then I've put the company text, or now the uh, company name, okay, so that data. Then I put add end in symbol, and then append, and pressed okay. So I'm just gonna let that happen write the data and then where I've told it to save if we have a look at that you'll see that it's saved as we've told it to the person's name put a comma in between and then the person's uh, the company that he works for in this case one nest uh, real estate so what we could uh, use that for guys is we could have come over to the file and uh, I'm not sure what you guys use um, on this uh, computer I have open office we could have opened it in Open Office or Excel, and there you go. So this would be great, guys, if you wanted to imagine if you were going to a hundred of these URLs or a thousand or twenty thousand, and you were collecting all the data from the pages. You could have a nice little spreadsheet with all the data. So maybe you could get some work a company paying for you. Maybe you're going to use it for your own bots. But I just wanted to show you a very basic method to save the data, and then you could present it in an Excel or an Open Office document for later use. Okay guys, that's it for now and I'll see you in the next video.